factor this expression, we are going to need to rewrite it as expressions multiplied together. So normally that's going to work out as two binomials in parentheses multiplied together, which are equivalent to the original. To do that, I'm going to look at the constant term, in this case 4, and I want to find factors of 4, which are going to add up to 5. So factors of 4, it could be 2 times 2, or 4 and 1. Of course, the 4 and 1 are going to be the ones that add up to 5. Then using these factors, I can now rewrite as two binomials multiplied together in the following way. x plus 4, 4 coming from here, and x plus 1. So that's it. My factoring is complete. And there are several reasons that we'll get into later that you might want to do that. But let me just leave by showing you why it works. Foil or multiply these together, my first terms, first times first, is going to be x squared. Then I get x times 1, or simply x. Then 4 times x is a 4x. Remember, the 4 and the 1 added up to the 5. And here we have a 1 and a 4 that add up to the 5x, which is in the original. And finally, our 4 times 1 is equal to 4. So we can see that these two combine, and it is equal to x squared plus 5x plus 4. So again, the answer in factored form is this. This is just showing you why it works. Thank you.